The holidays can be a tough time for a lot of people, but demand for mental health services has been growing for the last few years. On the South Island, the Foundry Victoria Youth Clinic is helping young people with mental health and addictions issues. In this week's Vital People, Tess Van Stratton shows us how they're making a difference. Justina Dirksen's a family nurse practitioner. She works at the Foundry Victoria Youth Clinic, where demand is high for mental health and substance abuse services. I think that there's a lot of compounding factors at play right now. You know, it's a pandemic, so there's a lot of isolation that can happen because of that. It's the winter time, it's dark, it's cold. And it's the holidays, which can be a tough time for a lot of people. There's a lot of family stressors, feeling of isolation and sadness over the holidays. So I think mental health is a growing concern in our community. Foundry Victoria provides health care and wellness supports, including mental health and addiction services, to youth aged 12 to 24. Our model is trying to meet a young person where they're at. So a young person can come in, not be sure of what they're needing to access or what they're looking for. They can talk to a counselor about what their needs might be. The overdose crisis has led to an increase in young people seeking substance use services, but tragically 2021 is the deadliest year on record in BC as toxic drugs continue to kill at an alarming rate. Have you lost claims here? We have. This year. It's devastating um, for young people to lose their lives, to lose friends, for families to lose their loved ones, their children, um, for staff to lose a young person that they care about is it's just been absolutely devastating. But help is available and they're hoping more people will reach out. It's a very stigmatized thing that carries a lot of shame and secretiveness. Um, and our approach as a society for folks who live with substance use disorder has been very punitive and moralistic when really it's a mental health diagnosis. There's also still a lot of stigma around mental health, but young people in particular are more willing to talk about it. Mental health is a really big issue for young people. I think it's something they're talking about. I think they see their friends seeking support, so it might open them up to seeking more support themselves. If you're struggling, know that you're not alone. You can call the 24-hour Vancouver Island Crisis Line for help. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.